and you calculate it and you put them into the calculation. Had they sort of stayed in the force, stayed looking, still not employed, but at least looking, the unemployment rate would be 9.1 percent. That's a truer reflection of what it's been like over the last year without the distortion of the way that we calculate unemployment. And it is just unbelievably awful. And that's why the administration now is trying, as always, to change the subject, to attack Romney, of course. But this, I think, if there was sort of a, a moral boost or some kind of enthusiasm coming out of Charlotte on the part of Democrats, I think that this puts a stop to it. At first, the Democrats said Mitt Romney was not specific in Tampa, didn't offer specifics. Then Mitt Romney said today Barack Obama didn't offer specifics. Well, Are we waiting for uh, the debates to get to uh, specifics? Well, I mean, as to the reality of the two charges, uh, the Republicans have uh, has offered so many specifics that the, the Democrats have been on the attack of the Romney-Ryan plan endlessly since the Ryan appointment and, and before. They've been tremendously detailed in their program about Medicare, which has been subject to attack, about taxes, about spending. Obama offered nothing, and not just he didn't offer it in his speech. You could say you don't offer that in the speech. He hasn't offered anything anywhere. He's been in office for a term. Has he offered anything on Medicare? Nothing. And he himself said on July 11th of last year that you could raise all the taxes you want in the world. It's not going to change the fact that Medicare is becoming insolvent. Has he done anything on Social Security, anything on entitlements? Has he done anything on tax reform? He actually had the audacity to refer him to, as he called it, my own debt commission, which he rejected. I mean, it is shameless and I thought extremely unconvincing.